hello guys welcome to this video so in this video today we'll talk about daily crypto news and uh, before looking at the news let's look at the coin market cap website right now bitcoin is been trading at eight thousand one hundred and thirty three dollars and as you can see there's see your blood right now and the whole market is down right now but within one or two weeks we will sooner or later will we will get to see bitcoin raising this bar because of the news of Bitcoin ETF and uh, let's move on with our further cryptocurrency news so the first news of the day is the largest movie theater chain in Thailand will start accepting Bitcoin so the Thailand's largest movie theater chain major cineplex is integrating crypto payments onto the platform to pay for its services and products including movie tickets and popcorn and they the Thailand Securities and Exchange Commission has started accepting license application from crypto operators. If you don't know about Major Cineplex, it holds 143 theaters throughout Thailand on its website and they have tied up with Rapid Pay, which is a Swiss payment company which will help for their smooth cryptocurrency payments in Thailand. If we talk about Rapid Pay, it is a Swiss payment company which uh, where merchants can use Rapid Pay point of sale system to accept cryptocurrency as well as fiat currencies. And they right now there are only three coins which have been listed on Rapid Pay that is Bitcoin, Litecoin, and Bitcoin Cash. But sooner we will get to see more coins as uh, the usage of cryptocurrency increases in the Thailand. So one of the members of major Cineplex group has stated that Rapid Pay will expand to other businesses and lead the change for Thailand's financial ecosystem. And you will be able to buy any services and product from major Cineplex such as movie tickets, popcorn and other different products with the help of cryptocurrency. So this is how Thailand is trying to gain more customers with the help of cryptocurrency. So let's move on with the second news that is Kim Kardashian West raises stakes with Bitcoin in charity poker night out. So Kim Kardashian is a popular influencer, Instagram influencer who has 100 million followers on Instagram. And Kim Kardashian has recently seen in a charity poker in Los Angeles to raise funds for City of Four, where she had uploaded a story of a of Bitcoin, of physical Bitcoin, of physical Bitcoin chips and after uploading it we got, got to see a little bit of rise in Bitcoin within the time of after the time of upload and as you can see Kim Kardashian had received a Kyla designed Bitcoin which was gifted by crypto entrepreneur Matt Rosek, who was also present at the tournament earlier that day and he also tweeted big fun at the first annual City of Hope charity poker tournament also gave Kim Kardashian a very fun Bitcoin Kardashian coin Yezzy coin so this was the tweet where the entrepreneur gifted Kardashian the physical Bitcoin and if you talk one of the members who have worked with Kardashian He's, he also stated that Kim is the most important powerful influencer in the world. Her reach extends far beyond her own brands. Every time she wears posts or talks about a fashion brand, there is an immediate and significant decrease in both awareness and sales. So this is how Kim Kardashian can influence Bitcoin if she starts posting things on Bitcoin. Let's move on with the third news that is Bitman which plans is IPO very soon and they have also earned 1 billion dollars in profit in the first quarter of 2018 so if you don't know Bitmain is it is a crypto mining hardware giant and uh, reportedly in June they have decided to, for an IPO likely in Hong Kong and they have also mentioned that they have earned around 1 billion dollar in net profit in the first quarter of 2018 so with an average they will earn about two to three billion dollars in profit for the year 2018 and if you talk about the funding rounds of bitmain 
in series a funding they had received 50 million dollars in the month of september 2017 and in series b they had received 12 billion dollars of funding and now they have valuing the total valuation for around 14 billion dollars a figure of almost 17 percent higher than the series b funding so this is how bitcoin bitmain is trying to earn gain more profit in the month of in the year 2018 and with the help of ipo they will try to raise more money to increase the profit so last so the last news for the day is litecoin founder charlie lee confirms ltc support for htc blockchain phone and he is also been onboarded as an advisor on the htc exodus smartphone platform so recently we got a tweet from htc exodus that they have onboarded charlie lee as an advisor for htc exodus and like charlie lee also tweeted on this as you can see met the htc exodus team last week and was really excited to hear the phone will support ltc and lightning network on litecoin natively i will be an advisor as i see having a secure crypto phone that makes ln simple is needed for mass adoption so this is how both the parties confirm about charlie lee being as an advisor on htc exodus and if you talk about the smartphone it is a blockchain powered smartphone where you can store any cryptocurrency and the three important main part of this smartphone is you can hold your own keys own your identity and data and phone will be the important hub so this is how they are trying to build the first blockchain based smartphone and it will support bitcoin and ethereum and as well as litecoin and sooner and if you talk about the blockchain based smartphone there is not only htc exodus but there is also smartphone uh, company like serian labs who are trying to build blockchain based smartphone name as Fini, which will be manufactured by most popular manufacturing company foxconn and it, it will be launched on the month of october in the month in the same month where htc exodus is going to be launched so this is going to be one of the most competing market for blockchain based smartphone in the coming years so let's see what we will get to see in the blockchain based smartphone market so, so guys if you have liked this video don't forget to share it and subscribe it